Oh man, it is beautiful out here, boys. Got some bugs, but it's cool. Today, we're talking about discipline. But before that, I want to talk about a scenario, right? Something that we all go through. I currently do it. I still go through it. But imagine you waking up on a Monday. It's another week. You're going to hate it because you're choosing to. And you hate your job. You have to clock in those eight hours, lock in again. And you go home. You're still broke you get one hour of free time so with that one hour you watch porn and like play video games because that's like the quickest dopamine you can get and then you rinse and repeat every single week my question is when are you going to stop this endless psych this video is listenable by the way the goal is 1000 subscribers make sure to like and subscribe because we are so close these bugs are super annoying but yeah i'm gonna stand for the rest of this because this is getting annoying as you guys can see this video is super raw so just do your homework, work out, do your thing. I'm gonna be not editing too much. We're on a pretty nice view right now, but yeah, I rented this place out for the next five days just so I could have the discipline to record. But yeah, so let's get into the video. One thing I noticed, this happened to me too, is that people will literally, everything is a choice. People will literally work a job that they hate, hang out with friends that they do not like, and do things that they don't want to do just because they choose to. That's the crazy thing. It doesn't matter your circumstance. It doesn't matter your environment. You're choosing to do these things. You're choosing to go to work every day. Yeah, you have bills to pay, but it's funny because I used to hate my job. I used to work at Burger King. Get a better job. That's like, it's like people overcomplicate it. If you hate your job, get a better job. If you hate working, work on a project so that eventually you don't have to work. That's the thing that kind of blows my mind. And I used to do it all the time, but everything you do is choice based. Same thing with your body. You have a bad diet, you're gonna be fat and ugly. And and I don't care, yes, call it body shaming, I don't care. I My first impression on people, if, especially if they're fat, it's their physique. Every time that's my first impression on people, I look at their physique, because it tells me how much discipline you have as a person. And it tells me how serious you take yourself. So that tells me you're gonna take me serious. If you're fat and slow, that tells me you don't take yourself serious, so you're not gonna take me serious. So physique, that's super big for me, but that I'm going on a tangent, I don't wanna do that. But everything you do is choice-based. If your physique sucks, that's your choice. If you're poor, that's your choice. And trust me, I've gone through all of these things, so I'm just talking to my past self. But if you have no money, you're poor. That's a choice. You're making that choice. Doesn't matter the circumstance. You can just get a better job. Get some more skills. Find a way to make other money. Hustle. DoorDash after work if you have to like literally get money. That's how you do it. Like I said, the examples. You work a job you hate, get a better job. Learn new skills. You hate your physique, work out consistently. Fix your diet. You are choosing all of these things. And Although this sucks, it's also a beautiful thing too, because then you can make the choice to change your life. I made this choice to change my life recently. Three years ago today, I was in a horrible spot. I had like 10 bucks to my name. I literally lost my car. I worked at Burger King. It was so bad. And then I it clicked in me, man. Like that, that working at Burger King really turned on that hustle because it's cool you have a job, it doesn't matter, make your money. That, that's motion too. But I just had such high expectations for myself that working at Burger King was the wake up call for me. I wanted to not hate my job. And you know, now I'm working in Equinox, which is this luxury gym. I work in the sales department where literally I send a couple emails out a day. I make a couple hundred a day. And then I could also work on my personal projects as well. I make my YouTube scripts at work. And I've always wanted to be a YouTuber as well. Who says I need 100,000 subscribers to be a YouTuber? All I need to do is behave like a YouTuber. I just need to treat this like a full-time job. So what am I doing? I'm in PA, look at the view. I'm in PA, writing down scripts, recording, this is like my fourth video today. I made the choice to do that. So in order to change your circumstance, in order to change your life, it all comes down to you. It all comes boiling back down to the center, which is you, the person. What are you gonna do to change your scenario? This is what I did. This is what I, guys, look where I am. Last five days I've been out here. This is my last day today. Tomorrow I go back to work, waking up at 5 a.m. 
driving straight to work to get some sales in, going home, working out at the gym with the boys. That's it. Like, change your circumstance. Hey, I gotta go inside soon. It is bad out here. But change your circumstance. Change your life. Make that choice. Make that choice. My videos on my channel will dive deeper on how you can make that choice because it kind of gets deeper than that. You need to, you know, obviously schedule your life. You need to plan ahead of time. You need to actually execute, which is the hardest part. But I have many videos on this YouTube channel that you can utilize to help change your life, to help make you a better person. But yeah, guys, it's beautiful out here. I feel great. Gonna work out soon. Life is freaking beautiful, bro. Like, I never thought I would be at this spot. Three years ago today, man, it was raining every day. Like, my soul felt like it was raining every day. I had no bread, bro. I had no money and i hated my life i decided to change that i've always wanted to be a youtuber and now i'm a youtuber because it doesn't matter if i'm not making money from it doesn't matter if i have a hundred thousand subs here i am i'm doing youtube videos i'm investing my time into it i'm happy i'm doing my thing but it all came down to a choice and i want you guys to make that choice to be better you must make that choice and it, like i said i said this like four times but it comes down to you i don't want to yap no more but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Soak up this view one more time. In the summer, I'm coming back here so I can get the trees. It's bug heavy though, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.